Hi, I'm Rick. It's the roast, blah, 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 etc. You get the fucking point. So, who's ready for some fucking VOD reviews? I know full course is. Got him! I forgot to say hi, YouTube. Fuck YouTube! No one cares about YouTube. <laughs> All right, introduction. Vega, I will bin you right here. You and your minimum chips. The fuck out of here. <laughs> uh, demonetized. Whoop. <laughs> Lucky I wasn't making anything anyway. Rick, let's review patch notes. Let's hope it's good. Right, hold my beer. <laughs> Things that'll never fucking happen. Rec partner program when? <sighs> anyway. Time to death, awesome. Finally decide the tiebreaker of the tiebreaker. Oh, shit. Is Wait, are you first? Hang on. Before I even fucking remember. Is it time? It is. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, 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 dear. The full course in Centaur in round three. Are you both here for this? Is it time? Or are we calling it off? Are we calling it off? Are they going <laughs> to survive? I just started eating. <laughs> oh, actually, no, wait, you guys actually get, you got lucky, because I'm pretty sure, yes, there is one VOD before you guys, there's one VOD before you, so you can actually eat, and then you can drink, <laughs> you have time, if it ends in another tie, yeah, look, it won't be good. But yeah, so the first VOD, because of the slight schmozzle that happened last week with uh, Vega and Earthquake's uh, donations, they they ended up they ended up both putting in the money, and we're gonna <laughs> they ended up putting it towards one of their friends, which is okay. I don't mind it because they were both there on the day for it, and unfortunately, I didn't have enough time to do both of their VODs at the end. So yes, the first the first VOD of the day is uh, Trent seven four one two three, aka Star Drain. Star Drain? I don't know how the fuck to pronounce this name. But yeah, he's their friend. So, this was recorded... Uh, apparently, this was recorded by Vega or uploaded by Vega. I don't know. One of them did it. It had been done. Don't involve me. I just did what I was told. You did an okay idea. You, you did okay, Earth. It's fine. You did okay. Now, it was recorded on your PC. Okay, so... Is he going to blame the hardware if, uh, if it goes badly or what? <laughs> So, this is Nocturne. How long does this have some fucking Nocturne gameplay? Your boy. On the fucking Nocturne. Alright, so... Alright, notepads ready. So, Lethal Tempo, Presence of Mind, Legend of Lacrity, Coup de Gras. Secondary, Sudden Impact, Ultimate Hunter. Huh. Hang on a second. Couple of things to check about, about these runes. I'm just making sure. Come get some! Yo, is that a sub? Sarah, who is this? Ah, Sarah, with seven months. Welcome back, Sarah. Mutual appreciation. Welcome back to the Binhead Army. Ragnar, how do I send Death Horse gameplay? Ah, uh, basically, if your if your game is that bad and I check it beforehand, I can just nominate the game be Death Horse. It's just a just a matter of perception, really. We just kind of suggest it at the time. So if your vods are that bad, we could probably look into it. You know, I got an artist to draw a female fervor, but I can't post it due to NSF. Can you DM that to me? Because I'm very nervous as to how that turned out. I'm going to go spend all my money on Katarina stuff. Here. <laughs> no worries, Sarah. Have fun. <laughs> but yeah. So, for secondaries, I I get Sudden Impact Ultimate Hunter. I do. Um, I'm just trying to figure out something. I, just, I need to figure this out quickly before I forget. Hang on. I need to find two more of these that actually prove my point. You know what? I think this is actually just randomized depending on what you want to do. So we're going to check these two as well. Nah, there's no way in hell I'd ever let the people do that. Okay. So yeah, I think you're actually right with these runes. These, these, the, these runes seem fine. Only because, right, the secondaries I was curious about if people would actually want to go for... Um, something alongside Sudden Impact, but then again, the stat buff just aren't worth it anymore. So this is actually quite fine to go for. I would recommend taking armor though, instead of health here, and the rest of it's fine. 
this is pretty slow. It's pretty spot on. Nice work. Been that long since I've seen an Octane game. I did not even realize like what people are taking these days, and it makes sense. I believe it. Hello, JLP8000. Yeah, I do VOD reviews. If you pop into that Discord, as was linked, definitely bring me some sometime. <laughs> what kind of special weirdness are you even, like, doing there, Mr. Terraformer? Eh? 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 Do you owe well in my chat? Don't, don't make them do it, man. Been over the... The game's a minute in. Vega, what's wrong with your computer, man? You get you got him into the game late? Minions have already spawned? What have you done, Vega? Have I do what I want. Is that so? There was a problem loading in. <laughs> I remember this. I was there. <laughs> Time to bin that computer. Get a new one. Oh my god, is that an Ivern? Oh, I forgot there was a Dunkmaster Ivern skin. Why is that in the game? I don't need like this Death Horse game. Uh, look, it's okay. This one isn't Death Horse. The next one is Death Horse. Only because I know Rap Stars games are usually hilarious. Your red is gone, BTW. Fun funnel strap for the ages. Are you going to go to his red? This is the question. Are you going to his red? Please take a better path than the one you are right now. Just go straight down, 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 go straight down. Why are you looping all the way around? Are you going to ward it? You're not even going to ward it. What the hell is this shit? You're going to get killed. Also, I would take W if I were you if you were going to go for this. Just purely because uh, the attack speed would do you more for this. This is a very risky idea. You're literally doing this in the open without an escape route, dude. Like, just pop, pop yourself over this side at least. Holy crap. Now you ward it? Yeah, this is bronze something. Hang on. It's bronze... No, it's silver four. Silver four. There you go, guys. It's silver four. According to... According to Vega, it's silver four. But yeah, this right here, this was fucking... That, that was just a silly idea, just purely because, like... If you're going to go for shit like that, dude, you have to actually plan out where you're going to go in and where you're going to go out. You would have just been so much better for it if you did not do that. FF15. This is a pretty, like, horrible game. <laughs> you honestly should have taken W seconds so you could kill it faster, and then the spell shield would have actually helped you get away from Zillion. I'm going to assume that Ivan did take the other thing. Do you not like attack space at all, bro? You're just literally right-clicking it and chasing after it. Like, at least move with it. Man, there's no concept of movement at all. It's horrible. Well, at least the gank paid off. I really wish you'd stop right-clicking on a target and just letting it chase after like that. Like, you can actually move alongside your target and with, like, movement ability, like, clicking and just attack click onto them afterwards. You'd be perfectly fine for this. I'm sad Yumi got shit, but the other skins aren't out yet. Yumi got shit. What? 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 
the new weave skins. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, those other skins aren't out yet. Fucking rip. That's all right. I still want to believe that the damaging, like, items would have been worth more than leveling this up. And not having any wards here is going to suck, but, yeah, we'll see. Mans doesn't kite camps at all. He just right-clicks on them and just, like, believes. <laughs> he uses the power of friendship to hopefully kill shit. Just right-clicks on it and hopes it dies. That's not the way it works, man. you got to actually, like, kite around a target, move around a target. Use right clicks around, like, for movement. Like, you're doing this like this now, but the moment this happens, you just right click and just leave it. That's not how you do it. Cut it back. Walk in and out. Just mousing over it doesn't make it die faster, dude. <laughs> power of God and anime are on their side. If the power of God and anime was on my side, do you think it'd like stop spamming me with OO and actually give me some fucking good times? Cause all I'm getting is just OO spam and no actual love right now. This is this is hurting the this is hurting the sanctity of the roast, boys. I'm just not fucking working with it. Beck, let me send you a smurf while I get 30 kills. How about fuck no? You could have W'd that as he was attacking you, but I'm glad you Never mind, it was late anyway, so you're fine. Maybe OO is their love language. Look, if if Full Course was telling me that he was that he loved me every single time he sent me an OO, I think Bunny would take exception to it. So let's not have it that way. Let me send you a hacker invo Oh god, not again. Wait, does it wrap you in a bug? I only did it once. I'm on to you, Full Course. I know there's more coming. And I know there will be more during the next VOD because I can just feel it. <laughs> Could feel it coming. Like, speaking of, I need another. I need another league vod. If anyone hasn't already sent me one or wants to send me one, I need one more for tomorrow. There's an Annie. Yes, there is. Man, I really wish you would take an attempt on actually kiting your camps. Like the amount of damaging, the amount of damage you've been taking from some of these camps that you're just not moving around at all is just really hurting the soul. What do you mean again? Again? I would send another, but my right click broke, so I can't play right. Yeah, look, Rapstar definitely takes some time off. That's a that's a pretty big feels bad man there. Now, I know you're in a hurry to get six, but man, I still don't believe what you did at the beginning was a good idea. And you played Hecarim before? Did you not know that? Yeah, there's a vod, there's a clip of him being an idiot. I'm sure he can find it with his Riven friend. Yeah, with his Riven friend. And the Riven Friend was actually less toxic. That's the funniest part. <laughs> and yeah, where's the clip? Show it to Mal. Being an idiot. Being an idiot is an understatement, man. I never agree with using, like, Nox ulti in top lane just purely because it just costs you dragon almost instantaneously. Oh my god! Well, at least you got him. And it's nice you're keeping Nasus in the game here, but Mountain Drake would have really been good for you if you actually did fight on bot side. Oh dear. He was just so high. Who was? It's bronze though, what is dragon? And it, and it was pretty high. Like, look at me! <laughs> Speedy boy. <laughs> it's a great, it was a, a very well named clip too. But there you go, Mal. Enjoy that clip. Don't be scared, it's just me reading Enya's mind. That's all it is. Imagine Annie da like dodging all those skill shots and then suddenly just getting done by Nort. Feels bad.
Please buy a pink ward. Please buy a pink ward. Please. I bet you Vega told him to buy that. <laughs> what a terrible scare. I, can't, I still can't believe Dump Master Ivern actually exists. I really can't. I really just can't. Also, why are you not going to bot side, dude? The dragon's been there for how long and you're not fucking there. What's the go? What's the go, bro? Why do you keep going back to top lane? Like, I don't understand why you're doing this. You literally have your ulti. You could have just gone for fucking, like, the gank on bot lane. Oh. Like, North didn't even have his ult because he used it in the previous fight on Annie. Come on! You do it with Nas? I don't think so. I don't understand what's taking rights only to make Dunk Master. Like, dude, no fucking shit, eh? But now they made resistance Alawi, so we're never going to see another Alawi skin for like 10 years. So this is the only time you actually attempt to kite around a mob. And it's lovely, but I really wish you'd do it more. I really do. Also, please try to shoot your, like your cloud in the direction that the thing is going so that you actually still get the AD buff while it's over there. Please don't ulti. $100 if you don't ulti right now. Oh, he had to do it anyway because he got away. But that's fine. Get the tower off this, please. Please go get the tower off this. Please. Go forth. Why are you using it now? It's already almost dead. What the f fuck? This is bad. You just wasted this. Okay, never mind. It didn't charge. If you get it all the way down towards the next one, it's not so bad. But this, like the placing of that was about to be so bad because it would have lost health for nothing. Shoot your goom. I was about to say that. It was going to be a really bad, bad way to put it. That must have I should have been the next dunk skin instead of Ivan. Definitely. I still don't get why Ivan got a dunk skin in the first place. Speaking of Ivan, he's here. He is here. Malawi by J4. Yeah, exactly. Like, there are so many characters that would be definitely more deserving of this, but we gave it to Ivor? I'm making us do in the further drawings. Wait, have you not, has this not happened yet, or have you already got it? Hell, Aatrox dunks on his Q. I mean, Aatrox would now. Uh, you don't need to start smiting anything at this point unless you actually believe someone's going to come over to you because you don't need the sustain and you don't need the smite anymore because no one's there. Oh, she's working on it. Okay, cool. Yeah, I know, I know Sarah wants that. 100%. So, yeah. Sad boy moment when he actually buys a control ward, hasn't used it yet. If he sells... Okay, good. He sold that. I'm glad he sold the refillable pot. If he sold the control uh, the control ward, I was actually going to kill. Yeah, run a Dark Master for the original Dark Master Master Yeet. Look, that'd be great, but imagine that will never happen now. Because it never made sense when they did it, and plus, Dunkey is no longer part of the League community, so it can't happen anymore. You really should have, like, every time your ulti is up as Nocturne, your immediate thought should be to gank bot lane. Because they honestly were not that far ahead until, like, the, you, until you started ignoring them. And there was definitely a possibility for you guys to kill them since you are running, like, Draven and, like, you have Draven and Pike who are very, like, good damaging laners. Don't do it. Not on that angle. Terrible angle. Wait, why did you flash and not ulti?
If you didn't waste your flash there, you could have flashed out. Are you joking? Oh, fuck. <laughs> you notice the red body walked over? Yeah, I'm glad he did. Fucking hell. That hurt. That hurt to watch. At least NASA is just like solely pushing in without a care in the world. Hey, when I play Nocturne, I lose. To yeah, that would suck. Wow. Nasus juke pot. Literally running in a straight line, you call it a juke. So at least Ivan's not around to make any use of this. It would be good if Nasus actually got the inhibitor before he like came into team fighting, but yeah. You want your split pusher to be the strong one. Of those two, yes, but like, in general, you still want your AD carry to be somewhat useful, and a, and a Draven that is ahead is always better, in most cases, if they actually know how to play it. I think, uh, you're at a point now where you don't need to use abilities on minions anymore. So you shouldn't be wasting your mana. Also, you're aware your team's fighting and you're not there. Well, I mean, congratulations on getting carried at this point. Honestly, though, like, I'll give you credit because your choice was actually, uh, did actually pay off for Nasus, but I feel like, it, I feel like he was going to win it anyway before that even happened. I mean, there's an opportunity to ult there, but I'm pretty sure he still has his ult. I really wish you'd stop casting your E on minions. You don't need to anymore. Um, the only reason I'm so quiet right now is only purely because they're just not doing anything around, like, you know, Nocturne's not doing anything around the actual game. He's just, he got Nasus ahead, Nasus is, was doing well, and now suddenly, like, the game is stagnated. Dude, I want KFC. Give me KFC. I don't care where you live, but okay. I'm like a whole state away, but you know, we'll get there. I should delete the coach BDW one just for just because it just because it would be funny. Owned liberal. <laughs> Uh, 
He's definitely getting auto modded, chat. If you use Flash on D, you're trolling. This guy knows what's up. This is the first team fight you've actually participated in in a while. Did he flash into a wall? Hang on, sorry, I was answering a message. Give me a sec. Let's let's actually just go over this whole fight and just figure out what's going on here. So they know Trinimir is not there because he's topside. Ulti's onto Trist. Doesn't W when he comes into the fight, takes a shitload of damage. Flashes into the wall. Oh god. Oh dear. Somehow still lives. Wow. That was lovely. And they surrendered. Wow. What a great game that was. Who would have thought there was so much to get from a 20 minute game? There is quite a bit. There's a few like basic stuff that you have to really just understand. I selected the game, so that's me. Well, that's your own fault, Vega. Sorry, I'm just checking something quickly before I go into the review. <laughs> He's sexting on stream. Fuck, I wish I was sexting on stream, dude. If only. But no, I'm not sexting. <laughs> Unfortunately, is very serious business involving me having to possibly answer the door, but I don't, so it's okay. <laughs> All right. So, this game was pretty fucking boring, I'm not going to lie to you. Your man's actually got a bit lost around the mid game. He had a very odd priority of what to do. But yeah, there's a few like a few very obvious things that we're going to talk about. So, let's get into this. First big mistake you made. So, yes, you know that they took your red and you wanted to go and take theirs as compensatory. Now that makes sense in the long run. However, what you did to get to that point was really really bad. You have to take a safer route into their jungle, which is literally going straight down through the bushes and warding on one side at least so you know where they're coming from. And then you quickly take it. Now, take W second so you have more DPS on the, on the objective. And then you literally just get out and go straight. Never stand in the place you were in. It was horrible. You made, the, you made your escape so fucking difficult that getting collapsed on was the least of your troubles. Being called a troll would have been the second best problem for you. Now, your skill build was fine other than that, but please stop using your abilities on camps when you're past, when you're past level 5. You don't need to. What you should be doing is working on actually ca uh, kiting your camps and just DPSing effectively. Just because you right-click on the mob doesn't mean you're fucking jungling. It doesn't make you a jungler. It just makes you a fucking bot. That's all it does. 
You're just sitting there, just letting the game do it for you. That's not how you play a game, bro. If you wanted it to do it that way, play a phone game. Legit. You wanted to right-click on something and have it do something? Play a fucking phone game. Now, next thing. Priorities for ganks. You did the right thing going, like, helping Nasus get into a good spot. But hard out ignoring bot lane when they have a Tristana is not the greatest fucking idea. Let's be honest. You have your ultimate. You have a really good way to actually get into bot lane. I don't see why you would not just spend one on bot lane to get Dragon. If their jungler had any fucking brains, they honestly should have taken the entire way through jungle. Like, they actually should have taken, like, bot lane and dragon from you, but you had the free opportunity to go back and take it afterwards, which you shouldn't have. Taking Riftold as a, like, as a substitute for them taking dragon, which was fine. Don't ever use it if you don't know what the, t what the tower health is. It was so low that you actually would have wasted it on their on the top turret, even though it was going to have one hit left. You're lucky it died before then. Um, secondary to that, please actually, like, understand that in most places around the map, your ulti is the better gap closer than your flash. If you have it, your flash can be an escape if you need it. But please just have a priority, have an order. Use the Q so that you're, you can move along the, the cloud that it leaves behind so that you always get the AD and the movement speed from it. So you use it more effectively that way. You don't just cast it in a direction because it's not a nuke. When you stand on it, it gives you AD and movement speed. Use it properly. Use your W to block shit. Use your E to slow them down and fear them. And then that's it. That's all she fucking wrote. Your runes do the rest. Your Oh, if you're running with someone, please just actually try and walk around them. wonder what they'll do to knock if they update him. Honestly, I don't know. It's an interesting thought. But yeah, there's a lot of things you really have to like learn about playing a, like, playing characters in League, and that is literally kiting camps and movement. Moving around your target while you're chasing them is just such a necessity. Yeah, if he's on that list, does that mean he'll never... like? Does that mean he won't get it now that other characters are getting it? Or are you just picking who's first? Are they just getting it anyway? Or no? But yeah, that'll about do it for this one. I didn't vote for anyone because I'm pretty sure my vote doesn't count for shit. Riot would do it anyway. Rex shows faith in Riot. I don't show faith in a lot of things, man. I barely have faith in myself. I think the one... The, the great thing about making people believe that you're involved with the community is literally just that. If you make them believe it then and you do something else anyway, it doesn't make a fucking difference. Show no faith in earthly things. Just, just the aliens that are my uh, particular thing. We see what DSP said about the whole project. Yeah, yeah. I have faith in you. Thank you. I just realized he called me Rock instead of Wreck. I should delete you from existence. You can't see it right now, but my heart is breaking. You know you fucked up when DSP blasts you. I don't even know what DSP did. What did DSP even do? You show me that necessarily the next five chances will out there. You may choose other to update other chances first. I don't think it's order. It's not even fucking there. DSP is Dark Side Phil. He's a Mortal Kombat streamer. And he's apparently a meme, but I've got no fucking clue why. He jerked off on stream. Eh. Loco Doko is still fucking here, dude. It doesn't make a fucking difference. If Loco Doko could still have a fucking career means nothing. 
And Loco Doco did way worse than what DSP would have done. Like, DSP was an arsehole and he jerked off on stream. Loco Doco is an arsehole, has jerked off on stream, and has done other worse things, apparently. As far as I've heard. I would constantly be scared of being watched if I was a streamer, and I'm a dev, so I'd definitely leave it on triple check. Dude, I've definitely triple checked my camera. Every time I've left, I've turned stream off. Believe it. Believe it. Believe it. Anyway, I'm pretty sure said visitor is not going to like have too much trouble if they come here. So I think I'm going to go on to the next one. Are you know, it's ready for death horse. I'm pretty sure the Nazi outfit would be worse. Uh, glove, mate. <laughs> I cover up my cam after I finish streaming. Eh. If anyone's stupid enough to watch me, even though I have it off afterwards, it's just a bad, it's just a silly idea. Now I'm going to make sure this works. I think this is the command. Okay, cool. The command works. We're on to the next game. Which means you two are going to finally have your death horse. The tie will end. I did push-ups for my own deaths. That's fine, Refstar, if you're feeling up to it. Just, hey, you can sigh all you want, full course, but we all have you on tape saying you were ready to do it on Wednesday. This is it. Also, i got to drive. You'll be push-ups for you then, Tara. Tara just wants to see us die. Possibly. You two ready for this? <sighs> I'm not being held responsible for what happens in this particular Death Horse game, but for everyone that's aware, we are playing Death Horse, which means you pick a character that is in this list. Oh, it's a fucking... Why would you do this to me, Repstar? It's a bloody spectator game. How horrible. In for push-ups? Cool. So... They're at the bottom there. Can anyone see them all? Anyway, I'll write. I'll I'll put them down for everyone. It is Alawi, Vi, Irelia, Tristana, Volibear, Volibear, versus Riven, Hecarim, Lysandra, Vane, Thresh, and you can't pick Vi. Okay, pulling up my notepad. So yeah, for Hecarim we have full course. I don't want to end up like Milo. Well, you're gonna. I know, I already apologize for that. Apologize again, Repstar, do it again. Of course, Vane is Enya. What a surprise. And Terra, okay. Next. Sent. I'll take Nia Jax. So, like a glove has chosen Ilawi. Did Miller do all of them? No, he did seven. He did seven. He has 153 to go. Thresh would have won it last time, so I'll pick him. So Centaurin has chosen Thresh. Oh boy. Does make it will make tracking Death Horse easier, definitely. Alright. Is everyone in for the for Death Horse? Last call. Pick a character. Ten push-ups if it dies, or a shot if you're if you're feeling daring. This will be the last Death Horse for at least a month, so be mindful of that. Remember, guys, executes don't count. The rule book is there if you need it. It's all there. You say that now. No, I'm definitely going to give Cent I'm going to give Centaur and full course a break. Dragon's stolen everyone drinks. Baron's stolen everyone drinks. Can you remind me how much Vayne dies when I get high? Sure, dude. Sure. Sure. Take the shots when you get home. Oh dear. Okay, that's that's nasty. All right, that's all of them then. All right, we'll go into Rep Star's Vi game. So Rep Star playing Vi. I need his runes and thingo. And why are they opening here? Why you do this? 
Is it there? Cool. Yep. All right. So now funny story about Vi. Aftershock, very viable on Vi. It's a sad, it's a sad thing to say, but it's definitely a thing. I don't want to drive with my arms. That's true. Understandable. Understandable. But yeah, so you have two choices to make. You either go electrocute and pray, or you go aftershock and beef it. Now, that said, I'm just going to close these because they're in the way. All right. So if you were going to go it, I will give you both builds just because I'm feeling nice about it. But yeah. So for electrocute, I would probably recommend yeah, electrocute sudden impact. Uh, this line is still bad, but I believe zombie ward is probably the safest at the moment. If you can actually find pink wards around to kill just because it gives more for that. But yeah. Um, then yeah, Rav you got Ravenous Hunter. I believe Relentless Hunter is better just because movement speed around the map is better. Then you got Triumph Coup de Gras, probably the better way to go. And you got attack speed, adaptive force and armor. That is fine. Just as a, as a secondary sort of choice, if you're curious, um, for Vi Aftershock, Shield Bash, but I believe it is, well, hang on. A few of them are different here. Give me a second. There's a few different ones. Give me two seconds, guys. I believe some people have gone conditioning here. And I don't really agree, but that's kind of the easiest way to really deal with it on Vice since that whole line's not particularly amazing for her. Um, since second wind, you're not going to do anything with and um, bone plate is kind of a rarity for early mid game. So I guess conditioning might be a worthwhile choice there. Um, and then some of them have gone revitalized just for the shield health. Other pe some people have gone unflinching as well. Other choice to take. And then yeah, secondary is they've got triumph alacrity more so than Triumph Coup de Gras. So that's a choice for you to make there if you want to. The shards are the same. It's really up to you there. I would still recommend... You, you prefer... Okay, you prefer Assassin Vite? Understandable. Wait, there is a Runecorn Conditioning? Yeah, look, I'm I'm not aware of it either. It's brand new for me. Hob or Aftershock, I don't do Electrocute. Hob has just gotten way worse, man. I don't recommend it anymore. It used to be good. It's shit now. Just the amount of nerfs that it has eaten over the past time, you will see much more... Uh, aftershock and electrocute. There's a couple of uh, hobs being thrown in there, but I don't know. I've still seen more aftershock than anything else. Either way, let's go. Okay, here we go. Really sorry, it's a replay one. Oh, you sorry? You one. better be sorry. Is it? Yeah, there we go. But um, yeah, no, it's it's uh, th this is one doozy of a game. And, uh, trust me, watch, watch till the end, because it's... Uh, watch oh, till the God. end, huh? Alright, we'll see about that, rep star, mate. So this is gold three. Jungle again. Bye. And I'm just here to, uh... Give you some ID of, um... Super Metro talk about Hob being bad. Happened. Um, I think he talked about it being nerfed, but I think his preference was still something else. I haven't really checked his FPG in a while. Also, yeah, imagine that taking W before they even get in here is not a really safe idea, but there since you're by, you can't do anything about it. Yeah, that's better. Now you have all the same information I had during the game. You shouldn't have even stayed I'm near it because you went W first. Wait, why is it? I, I, I was watching the replay earlier. Um... Ignore Riven's it. items, dude. Look at Riven's yeah, starting yeah, items. <laughs> Interesting. Something so, someone should tell Ryan about that. Yeah, uh, this is why replays suck, by the way. It's why I don't like oh. taking on replays because they never fucking really work the way you'd want them to. Still here to steal my red, but you'll you'll you'll, you'll see in a moment what kind of weird ass janky shit Hecarim was pulling. Is he at your? Reason. Is he at your wraiths? Uh. I was like, wait, what? And I just kept walking because I was like, yeah, I, I'm not gonna take that fight. I can't. Riven, uh, <laughs> Hecarim was at your red. I mean, your 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 chickens. Okay.
Yeah, this is the last game, I believe, that is on the old system, by the way. So if anyone's going to ask, it's, yeah, this is the last time you will see it on old system. With, uh, thingos, not spawning. You going to help him? Unfortunately, not having Q makes this very difficult. But he dies anyway. And now I suddenly realize, wait, he was level two. He didn't do his ret yet. Yeah, about to say you would probably spot this because he didn't have a buff. Is that a refresh blue you have though? I didn't even check. This is a really silly fucking game so far. What the hell is going on here? But yeah, you get a free claim at his jungle. The funny thing is that Lau is still surviving against Riven. That's hilarious. So yeah, if you run, you're fine. Easy. Then yeah, Lowry has to flash away because he goes forward for the play, which is a silly idea. I said, this is kind of free. Yeah, that's free poke. But he's fighting you? The boy? What is that Hecarim doing? This is a stupid game, bro. Should I have ganked top at this moment? If you knew what summoners he had, you could have gone top. Because there's no chance the jungler would have fought you. The problem is, you can't really, like, lock Riven down without your ultimate. So you kind of, like, you can't really do much there. You're only just making breathing room for a Lowy. You have to, like, you have to fight that fight in top lane for an Lowy if they engage onto her. No way. Riven, double kill. Aw, oh, shit. Here we go again. This is, by the way, a sound bug with Alawi's um, thingy that whenever somebody in the game gets Alawi's um, spirit thingy on them. Yes, I know. This sound is globally heard in replay. Fire. Why are you maxing Some W first? Weird reason. I only discovered it. Why? 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 It why? why wait, no, no don't even, I don't even care that what you're talking about now. But why are you maxing W first? There you go again. Why are you maxing W first? You shouldn't even have more than... You shouldn't even have the extra point in it, bruh. It is pointless. It is absolutely pointless to do. No, no, Ajax botched it as you... <laughs> That works. Vega, do you want to get booted? Because this is how you get booted. I mean, it's unfortunate that it's a wind drake, but it's a drake nonetheless. Uh, you're kind of giving yourself away by doing this, though. Just given that, like, if you're timing this effectively, you you could have just gone to his blue first and checked if he was there. Rather than going to dragon and then going there. Because if he was at least, if he had a brain, he would just be there waiting, like, tr doing his blue or waiting for you to be there. Makes no sense. Vi melts dragon without the fucking second, uh, set of, second point in W, dude. You're just kneecapping your early game by taking another point in W. It doesn't make a difference. That one percent won't make a fucking difference. Properly, um, like doing your e, like your E and Q, and just maintaining your shield will do just fine for it. Killing that ward is a bad idea. Killing that ward's a bad idea just purely because they now they know you're there. If you just let, if you leave it dead and then you go for a lane gank, they won't even know better. What are they three wind drakes already? It's bro, it's a bug. That so fucking unfortunate. That was shit. That, that was, there was no point in doing that. You could have waited the entire time and it, he would have just chased him over and it would have been fine. Easy kill though. Ended up still getting the kill, but... You should be pushing the wave in. You should be hard clearing the wave. But you're not. Could have gone for that turret easily. The flash was horrible. When was the last time you saw it? 
That is the. F He's only taken one drake. So yeah, it's currently two deaths for Hecarim. And how many deaths for Thresh? I can't see it because I've got the bar in the way. Give me a second. One death for Thresh. So Centaurin's winning so far. A while ago before Hob nerfs. I mean, with Hob it would make sense, but... You know, there's no point. You're better off just going Q in most situations. Oh crap, sorry. I... I almost guarantee I bet on the losing horse. <laughs> Wait, was this the... Was this... Oh. So he knows you're there because he lensed you. I don't know why he used it like this that, but... I started to feel sorry for the Hecarim, because I'm pretty sure he hasn't gotten a single buff. Wait, he went into you. Far. What? You... I mean, only because your camera's locked, I can't really tell, but I have a feeling you could have actually helped him in that fight. Like, a, a well-hit like like well hit Q onto him would have been a good thing. Thresh dead. No missing pings. Nip. Who missing pings anymore, dude? Elari wasn't coming and pinged you away. Makes sense. All right, I get you. Yeah, it makes sense. I listened to the ping. Got a 5-0 in lane as Katarina after a triple in river and blah, 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 win one on 20. Feels fucking good, man. Why didn't you just gank bot over and over again? If you're 5-0 and you have a lead, why not just keep ganking bot? Why not just keep ganking? You have the, you should have the monies for like good items. Well, at least Hecarim was stupid enough to stay still and die. The only problem with Vi is how telegraphed their fucking Q is. So if you mess that up, you just get ruined each time. So I rip Hecarim again. This is not a good day for full course. I didn't sign up for this, I was forced. Technically, you forced yourself. <clears throat> hey, I have you on video, man. You can't get out of it. In the same sentence, you called... <laughs> you called Wacky a furry, and you weren't happy with him. <laughs> Vane doing well, I'm proud. Three, 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 and you're proud. Hmm. Mikey called him a furry as well. It was okay. She dies, as I said. It's unfortunate, but you get there in the end. He, I'm about to say, he has used Ghost. Which means he actually intends on fighting you. He used Smite on the thing. Oh my god. I so you know there's no reason to fight that, right? <laughs> god, you're an idiot, rep. That was so stupid. Uh, I wonder how much money you were sitting on prior to that, too. Oh, wow. A completed Warrior Enchant and a Phage. Wow. You're right, but I was expecting it tomorrow. I said Wednesday! Which is Tuesday night, you guys. I said that. I 
I think you uh, you might have to concede defeat here, Mr. Like, full course, like, mate. How the fuck am I out farming the our ADC? Good thing I'm doing arm twists. Arm twists? Sixty kilogram bar. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Ten H. Is that like five per arm or what? Oh, never mind. Down goes Thresh. By the way, Rev, I think this is probably the fourth time in as many vods where I've actually like noticed you go. You go home at almost never. Like you just go home so late. And then you've got, you're sitting on all that money, and then you go for a shitty fight and you get killed. Every time. Taking a straight bar and bending it, nice. <sighs> okay, so they got Rift Herald. I can't believe Hecarim didn't just come down to check the buff. Just so he could get Riven to come down too. That's just silly. Lifting is just a primitive form of bending. You're gonna break you're gonna squeeze the life out of him, are you? Okay. How much money you're sitting on this time? Too much, probably. Yeah, I have to like keep an eye on your actual like gold spike timings, dude. It will make your life so much better. Fuck, Hecarim's dead again. Rip Riven. There's Thresh dead. Rep, do 20 push ups for that one. I hope from here you're actually looking for an, an attempt to take either like more ground in mid or just take the next dragon. You're just going straight forward instead. Jesus. Did someone summoned a rift throw somewhere. I don't even know where the hell it is. Oh, he used it and then died. The second room's not having a good day. 80 bands is going to be a good lift there. You're going to have a good time, my friend. I'm sure you will attribute all of your gains to me by the end of this. The follow bear's about to feed. Please don't, d don't ever channel Q that early, because you were so slow coming towards that fight, you did nothing. That went better than expected. Dude, what is Super Metroid running anyway? At this point, I'll even feel them. Ooh. I 
Mech Room dead again. <laughs> Yeah, the guy that plays Vayne. Oh, not Vayne. Uh, Vi. Vayne. Vi. He's a Vi one trick. A pretty good one from what I remember, too. This is a stomp. This is not a particularly great one. He runs Aftershock? Makes sense. Staying for too long again. Sitting on so much money again. Giving away all that money to the vein. This is this is why you guys lose. Your first choice is gonna be Volibear. Imagine. I'm a spoil we lose this game. Banned. Banned! Hindsight Hindsight's always 2020, bruh. You never second guess yourself. Oh, Thresh. Thresh is in trouble. Via AFK. Thresh is dead. The funny thing is that you guys actually still managed to somehow pick the two most deaths in this game. Ugh. Actually managed to pick the two highest deaths in this game. You're going straight to... I like how your timing is buffs, but you're just going there without even putting vision up. You're just literally walking in there and just expecting to take it. How stupid that is. I don't always get bet wrong, but when I do, I get shit-faced. Yes! Ten deaths for Hecarim. How much longer is in this game? Oh my god, we're not even we're just over halfway. Scary shit, guys. Scary. I like how like they just took inhibitor, and you're in there. Oh, hang on, this is Thresh death. Thresh death. You're sitting in their base, BMing, instead of just taking objectives. Oh dear. I literally bet on a horse this game. <sighs> this is a free Baron. But again, still no fucking vision anywhere. You have two control wards in your inventory and wards to boot. You fucking just not even... Just don't ward shit, bro. Even miss your smite to boot. Wow. Wow. Oh. Why you do me like this, rep? Support's fault. You fucking what, mate? You feeling pretty good? Just placing your bets. This is nothing on when Sam picked Blitz. <laughs> I meant with the bars, so I was the confidence I will lose. <laughs> that bad, huh? Still the same pick I placed there for the first trade. Yeah, that doesn't make it good, by the way. Because you are going to other objectives. Leaving pinks there is still a shitty thing to do. Rip Lissandra. Sandra. 
If it was telling me last game he was spamming buy a pink, and then said Vega told him to buy that, you were 100% correct. <laughs> sure, I, just broke I knew it. I had a feeling you you had a hand in that Vega. Because he bought them and he didn't fucking use them all game, so go figure, he was definitely you that told him that. I just realized I didn't actually get check his fucking match history either. Shit. I can only guarantee that he forgot to fucking ward the entire game anyway. I checked his I checked his match history, but I forgot to check his fucking wards. Oh, that's a feat. Hecarim died again, though. I can't believe you all didn't take top in here, but instead chased the Riven down. Like, are you, like, you guys have just got some special fucking damage going on here, hey. And meanwhile, Allow is still staying in their base, thinking that this is a good idea. Oh my god. Oh my god. First got to kill, I'll drink to that. You're not meant to do that, Sent, for your own safety. For your own safety, you shouldn't do that. Here we go, the Alawi fucking laying it down. <laughs> Here comes Nia Jax. <laughs> Can't stop, won't stop. Vane with the frags. So yeah, this, this is the part where... Uh things start going wrong. What? Where you run into their base and start inting? Because it certainly looks like it. Well, at least, at least you killed Vayne. At what cost? No one knows. Yes, you can. I'm pretty sure you can. Fucking the Irelia though. The Irelia has killed Pekarim. <laughs> Possibly Thrash. Never mind. Just just Pekarim. The idiot himself. Oh dear. Oh dear. He said the word. Banned. <laughs> 140. This is just mounting. Yeah, look. Rex said it banned. Ah! He banned. Hey, at least I don't have a Canadian accent, dude. That's when you know it's trouble. It's going to be trouble if I have a Canadian accent. We need to stop going in one by one. Are you all just going to keep running into their jungle one by one and dying? Is that what's going on here? Well, and, um, <sighs> then this happens. Oh wow, the Hecarim actually did something good. The Hecarim actually cut you off. Oh my god. And this is where Assassin Vi becomes bad. Fucking sure I spent that entire fight CC. Yeah, you would have. Imagine if you had aftershock and I'm flinching. <laughs> We're gonna shake hands when we meet big guy. Hey look, if I even have hands by then, it's cool. Besides, you should be thanking me. I'm giving you great workout time. Where's my thank you? Huh? You won't when I'm done. Hey, look, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I won't anyway at this point. What was that about Canadian accents? Um, apparently, T is it TF Blade? TF Blade's Canadian, isn't he? Canadian and something else. But I was just, yeah. Um, apparently his thick accent. Is it? <laughs> Listen, buddy. <laughs> he said Rex said the word. Hey, at least when I said it, it doesn't sound like anything remotely like an N-bomb, so. Fuck you. And the horse you rode in on. Speaking of horses. Ooh, rip thrash. 
and Hecarim, and Vayne, and Lissandra. I'm not your buddy, pal. I'm not your but I'm not your pal. Isn't it Guy? I thought it was Guy. I've never got the wrong way around. I always forget this one. It's bad. There's a no. random pound sign in there, and yeah, I don't know what to do. At this point, um, half the team. You guys could. Yelling, do Baron. Are you going to end it? The other half end? of the team was yelling to just end. At the very least, you could take both inhibs, which My is good. Opinion is we should have done Baron. You should have, you, uh, if you get both inhibs, this is okay. Feeling, and then you can go for Baron after that, because it's and free. And then, um, yeah, you, I don't think you can end. Come get some! Wicked! 15 fucking months. Love it. 15 months with this gorgeous hunk. Oh, flattering me too much, man. How are you in line? We're going good, man. I'm real good. Well, we as a partnership are going well. I, on the other hand, am terrible. But <laughs> no, but no, we're doing okay. We're, we're, we're scraping by, but we're getting there. We're getting there. So this, this is where you don't get both inhibs and and wait. And you instead you force Baron and you get completely shit canned by them running on you guys, right? This is it right here. Did you just flash at him? And leave your AD carry to die. I think you did. Oh, never mind. Trist lived. 389 bits. You're always doing terrible. It's called being here. Uh, dude, I'm a broken human, let's be honest. But th <laughs> thank you for the 389 bits, Mr. Wicked. Thank you, Muchly. I got you got absolutely I rolled by flying back into that fight for no much. reason. Everyone's going in so one by many one. Times this game. I just fucking realized that. That's like the fourth, fourth or fifth time that Hourglass cocked me. Oh dear. Yeah, the ulti, the wave. Why is the score 54 versus 41? I don't know, man. Hecarim has 15 deaths, though. That might be part of the thing. How do you die 10 times as Lissandra? Don't know. Maybe because he has 115 CS at 30 minutes. Might be part of the problem. Oh, and rip pink that Literally singe without the tail. The start of the fucking game. <laughs> you are literally all health and no like survival stats. Any wonder you're getting shit canned by Vayne. She just shreds you each time. It is us. Look at how fed the game is. I mean, this is on Europe, right? Maybe it is you two on the other team. I have Tarby. Versus the Zoe where I was double the CS all game there for 15 like I was playing Akali and suck at CS as a freak because she never harassed me. It's good, isn't it? People not actually knowing how to play their character. Effectively. Finally award placement. It's been a while. And they got free lands like that and rank out smash all game. Yeah, look, imagine. Imagine. I mean, you technically do because it's still the same sort of rank, but you know, get potato, potato. Potato, potato. At least Thresh dies before the end. And Hecarim. But no one goes for Vayne at all. And yeah. Literally no one went for Vayne at all. Vayne. 
Yeah, you have to actually have like survival stats to do a, a dive like that at the beginning of the fight. Or, or else you have to wait for Alawi to start the fight. Oh my god, he missed. Oh dear. So yeah, that happened. A set of 30 for a week and I'll reach my debt. Your debt! Uh, yeah, so we kind of threw that, but I'm not sure how, apart from the fact that the Vayne ended up getting 27 kills. Yeah, I'd, I'd really like your help on this one. Mm. <sighs> that was a lovely, 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 lovely int fest there. I don't like Death Horse, I'm exhausted. You don't? You'll get used to it. It's all a part of getting fit. So, congratulations to Centaurin. You are our current Death Horse champion. Congratulations. For now, yes. But yeah, congratulations, Centaurin. Well done. I haven't done a push up in about five years. I just did 70. <laughs> so, after all that shit last week, Centaurin and Fulcross have finally settled their differences and, and Centaurin has won. Congratulations. You win absolutely nothing. But it was good. He's lost most. I'll be back next month. He's definitely, he's definitely, uh, yeah, been pretty painful. He's finally won a, a Death Horse game, which is good for him because he's... I think the morale was starting to dwindle a lot after previous times. Birthday party, time to drink. Awesome parking spot, time to drink. Wake up early, time to drink. Intervention, time to drink. <laughs> you should get VIP for a wiggly. You know, I think Satorin just earns the VIP role generally just because, like, the guy has literally suffered through way too much in Death Horse. And just because Death Horse champion kind of deserves it. So I think, I, I, I think uh, you all can agree. That I think Centaurin has earned his uh has earned his VIP token. Yeah. I, th I think y'all can agree with me on this. The twenty one death blitzcrank. Yeah, I'm gonna agree with it. Congratulations, Centaurin. You are now VIP. Very well earned. <laughs> Man, Mans has definitely held his drink for way too long. <laughs> oh, I still have to do 60 push-ups as well. Uh, apparently, wait, who picked Vane as well that I had to be reminded? Vane, there were nine on Vane, so that means Terra, someone has to let Terra know that there were nine for Vane too. But yeah. So, the real problem with this game for you, Repstar, mate, 100%, it's all to do with like just pushing the lead properly. There was too too many situations where you were just looking for the kills and not actually taking an objective, and that was just even worse. Yeah, twenty for that one death as well. That was yeah. No worries, Terry. Got to add those add those add a stop sign. Well, welcome. <laughs> but yeah, um, I, I I will never I will never be happy when I see a person that literally runs off from an objective. From a one from a one game to get a kill and then ends up losing the game off the back of it. So yeah. When you when you and Volibear killed Hecarim, bot tower was there. You had to take it. When you were um when you were mid as well, could have taken it. When you killed Lysandra at the inhibitor, you could have killed the inhibitor. There were just too many situations where you just did not take it from there. Look at this fucking gold lead you have, dude. Look at it! Look at it! The fact that you lost off the back of this is just fucking monumentally bad. Ugh. Too many... Uh, look at these situations where you're going without buying anything. You went seven minutes without buying. Another four here without buying. Massive amounts of gold, by the way. Like, those situations where you just spend all this time away from base. Like, you have to go and buy, dude. If you've got this lead, you've got to use it. 
you can't just like you can't just feel yourself and suddenly believe that you're going to be able to win it just does not work 12 wards with three control wards <laughs> terrible I'm still mad that you actually still think that leaving a ward somewhere is good play. It does not work. It does not work. There is no universe where just putting a ward randomly in the river and it stays there the entire game is good practice. It's not. You have to move the wards again and again and again. There's no other way to do it. Cream always rises to the top. <laughs> Do I hear Randy Savage going on in my chat? TBH, I know that I was just not on point with my vision this game. Understandable. You know it. Can they make me a champ where I get 1 AD, 1 AP every time I place a ward? Um, I believe if you destroy a ward with, uh, with a zombie ward, you get AD and AP for it. Just a thought. Potato, potato. Oh, you can get ghost poro awards. Imagine that. Ghost poros. <laughs> you do, and you get AD and AP for that. It's not a character, but it's a rune. It's literally ghost poro. It's literally ghost poro, bro. But yeah, pretty solid game overall. Massive throw. Good times for that. So... For those that participated in this particular one, we had Full Course, Enya, Terra, Glove, and Centaurin. And yeah, looks like Centaurin uh, wins this one on behalf of the duel between you two, with 11 deaths to 16. Uh, as for the actual winner of this game, that win goes to Vane. How, wait, who did Glove pick? Alawi. No, wait, Alawi won. Congratulations, Like a Glove, on winning today's full, uh, winning today's Death Horse. I mean, today's full course I was about to say. I'm like, wait, that doesn't say that doesn't make sense. So congratulations, like a glove. You had the least deaths on eight. On eight. eight. Holy shit. <laughs> wow. So yeah, war better, push lead focus. Actually remember to buy your shit and war better. There you go, Repstar. Go and get plat. I never win something. You win the opportunity to be a mod for my stream. You should be stoked, Anya. Who would have thought to bet on... Dude, if anyone actually thought to bet on Volibear. Look at the look at Volibear's KDA, dude. The guy actually, like... Yeah. And yeah, are you even doing your work right now? I'm pretty sure the only moderating that's been done this stream is me muting you. I did, but I thought I guess it. But you did. Fucking <laughs> Satoru. But you didn't. But you didn't. Oh, dear. What is that to do but drink? Yeah, look, you're onto something. No work gets done because I ain't mod. Do you even want to be a mod here? Actually, real talk, if I had if I had a mod sword to Wicked's thing, does he have four em emblems then? Because he's the top bits guy as well. That's a scary thought. But no, you know you're often enough, so it's no point. No? Would it eat one? VIP or mod, not both. Bullshit! Really? Let's see. So he does. How weird. Tried to VIP my mind and says you get model VIP. Yeah, it's unfortunate. So, unfortunately, Anya, you have to sit with the ugly green sword for a little while. <laughs> a little while longer. It looks funnier when you have the bin head, because it actually looks like you're holding it like as you're charging into war, because the bin head's facing that way as well. But, you know, you're not subbed to me, so you can't get it. So, you suck, Anya. You suck. Green sword is moderator. He has to actually pretend he's working in my stream. But in truth, he's really just here for the free love. <clears throat> what is this? Someone tagged me in Discord. I was VIP for a bit, Pog. It's a lie. Not subbed, but mod. Yeah, look, I'm just as confused as you are. 
that needs to be fixed. Needs to be fixed. <laughs> uh, all right. So here's here's the dilemma, right? I can't do any more VODs today because I'm going to ha not have any for tomorrow. I've got two that I can do tomorrow, but I need a third. I don't have anyone in my DMs for it. I actually thought I had more, but apparently I've only got four, which doesn't make sense. It's very tough. But yeah. Come get some. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Wicked 9090 gifted a sub to Enya Vane. So congratulations, Enya Vane. Welcome back to the Binhead Army. You can't hate anyone anymore. Oh, congrats on your bronze bin. Perfect. Perfect. Bronze bin for Enya. Love it. <laughs> thank you very much, Wicked, for gifting that sub. Mucho appreciation and love. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Can you move the sword and bit? No, you can't move it around. It's just it's just an order. Like the sword or the VIP is always at the front, then the sub icon, and then either your um your Twitch Prime or your leading bits or anything like that. The bin is second. The mod the mod's always first. Yeah, it looks like a bin holds the sword. Yeah, it's good. The bin holds the sword for like it's like it's like it's in his left hand. He's like, Yeah, gonna kill things. Whee! But yeah. So yeah, I need another fucking VOD. Do y'all know anyone that wants to submit a VOD to the roast or has has wanted to do so and has never found the time, you should definitely get them in my DMs. Because at this point, I need a third VOD for tomorrow. It would help. I will eventually. I just have to find one. No worries. Expose. I told you I owe you an average game. This is true. This is true. A runs in for any nights the same way as any vein should. Oh, as all vein men should have. That's just tough. I should I get a nice Akali one tonight? Mm, bit of a Akali. Bit of fun. But yeah, we'll figure something out, chat. I'm sure we'll all find something that we're ready to go for. Uh, that happened about five minutes ago. Five, ten minutes ago. Because I I actually think Centaurin has taken way too many shots for this stream. So, yeah, he can he can definitely sit on that, that bin. And plus, he's my IT guy. I got to give him love for that. The guy has actually sat there when I tried to, like, play uh, L.A. Noir. He deserved it. Gets an award for drinking. Nah, he, he more so gets it because of the IT help. The IT help I really needed. And Centaurum was always there. It was good. What are your thoughts on Yumi Jungle? Please never do Yumi Jungle. Please, please never do Yumi Jungle. Please. You realize once you have a VIP badge, you can't leave. You can't leave the roast. You're not allowed. I got mine for the Diana play. That was like... <laughs> that was like the final nail in the coffin for me, Wicked. Everything else going like better or worse from that so I can leave. No, you're a mod idiot. You have to stay. Thoughts on why it's fine. Now? I haven't watched it yet. What does Yumi even do well? Adds damage. That's pretty much it. Do it. I will. I will. I will. I will. I promise. I promise. I promise. I will get it done. Ugh, all right. Watch why. Watch YouTube while stuck to your AD carry. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Although I have a feeling me and Lana will get back into league just so she can play Yumi and I'll have to play an AD carry. So that's going to suck. That's going to royally suck. I hate playing AD carry. As much as I enjoy playing with Lana, I really hate playing AD carry. Ugh. Can I ever come? Play Vane. Play Vane, you reckon? Play Vane and record it. Yikers. My missus plays Nami and I can't ADC. Actually, speaking of, full course, can you play AD carry at all? Is Fulcor still... Is Fulcor dead? Okay, good. 
I'm thinking like next year's Valentine's. I really want to see like all the couples try and play like 80 carry support together. It seems like all the it seems like all the happy ladies in here are playing like good support times, but their 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 partners are just never there for them. So yeah, next year's Valentine's. I want to get everyone to fucking send in couples vods for shits and gigs. You want to do it with full course? No, that's what Bunny's there for, you idiot. So I want to be my lady next year. Oh, I'm sure we'll find someone. We will, we will play matchmaker as well, just for shits and gigs. I've got to find myself an ego. Repstar, you are an ego. I hate landing with her. <laughs> That's what makes it fun. You have to record it. I want to hear all that angry bickering between the couples. It's going to be great. But yeah, that's that's a while away at least. So you'll have time to to build up your AD carry support synergy. Brand Nami bot lane duo. That'll work. Nami Leona bot lane pog. I mean, for shits and gigs, I'll probably do like an Olaf lane. Be good. When Clash coming back? Fucking never, apparently. We're actually so bad together. It's hilarious. I, I honestly, I've heard stories, Vega, but I'm ready to see it in action. I think it needs to be done. Clash failed. Dude. Ca Ugh. Clash was so good for what it was, and it was just fucking awkward. Is he Mr. Sire ranked the new glove? Get an AD, being to play Velkos Nami. Oh, yeah. I'm so ready to see that. The moment he misses a skill shot, fucking Earth will be all over him. It'll be so good. She'll be like, why did you miss that? She was when she played. Oh, give her a nice cuddle. Bring her back. It was a good attempt, but they should just bring back rank team Q. Yeah, look, I, I wouldn't mind it coming back personally. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. It's tough. It's tough. Anyway, I'm in dire need of some fucking food. Ugh. So, that will be it for today. Why did you miss that? Because I suck at geometry. Oh, God. But, yeah, I am going to go and have some lunch. I need, yeah, I do need at least one VOD before tomorrow. If anyone can manage to get me one, it would be much appreciated. I'll put an announcement out in Discord just to make sure everyone gets through. But... Yeah, y'all get some sleep. Y'all do what you're doing. Thank you, everyone that came to the roast today. The VODs will be up this afternoon, slash tonight, depending on how I'm feeling. Hope everyone enjoyed themselves. Love you all. And of course, best to you. Bye-bye.